In view of the final reveal of the Cybertruck, how about if BMW gave us a full-size Empire pickup truck like this one? Old, futuristic, good-looking, and Empire-bashed. BMW actually considered luxury pickup trucks some time ago in 2019, but today we strongly believe that BMW performance truck landscape is ripe for re-entry by BMW, guys. It is time they planted a pickup seat. A while ago in a roundtable discussion with the head of BMW Design, Dukic, it was suggested that BMW is eyeing several new vehicle segments, one of which is a pickup truck. And Dukic actually said that since he's been a BMW, people have always been asking for a BMW pickup truck. But the premium pickup segment is a tough nut to crack. Just ask Mercedes. That's what Duque said. Speaking of Mercedes, we know Mercedes famously tried and failed with a luxury pickup called the X-Plus, this guy, based on a platform borrowed from Nissan. The truck actually debuted in 2017 and production ended in 2020. That's three years down the line. It shared the same underpinnings with the Nissan Navara and production happened at the Automakers plant in Barcelona, Spain. Now, BMW called that the X-Class disappointment at the time, and that was proved accurate as only a few years later, the S-Class was abruptly pulled out of the global market, guys. You can't see it anywhere. And the S-Class was very pricey compared to the competitors. In Germany, it was actually 16,000 euros more than the base Navara and about 4,000 euros more than the Renault Alaskan, which was also based on the same platform. But that's Mercedes-Benz. Let me talk about Audi. Audi also followed suit in the footsteps of the Cybertruck's futuristic design and massive performance numbers, guys. So we all do remember the Audi Active, Active Sphere concept, this one. The Audi Active Sphere concept recently showed the Four Rings idea for creating a luxury vehicle with a truck bed, reminding us of the Tesla Cybertruck and the quad bike that sat in a truck bed. So rather than looking like a traditional pickup, just think about the Cybertruck. The vehicle had a sleek arcing roof, a power operated glass panel at the back that could slide away to make room for larger cargo. Still the, the tonal cover for the Cybertruck, right? The designers even made spots specifically for carrying e-bikes, just as the Tesla Cybertruck could carry quad bikes. Now that is a testimony to the luxury performance pickup truck era. And we believe there is no better time than now to focus on entering into this market. Additionally, the US market has the Rivian R1T. And if you move away from the Rivian 1RT, you've got the mainstream brands that have upped their pickup game with models like the Toyota Tundra Capstone trim. We also got the GMC Sierra 1500 Denali Ultimate and the Ford F-150 Lightning Platinum, guys. So all these are evidence to the fact that that market is okay, is ready to be entered into. Now, at a point, head of BMW design, that uh, Duke even went on to say that they have calculated that a luxury truck would just be for the U.S. market, but those calculations may be changing. The time seems to be about right for BMW to revisit this particular niche. And that explains why we have all these artistic impressions of how a BMW pickup truck could look like and fit in, especially with an M performance package, guys. So let me flip through all the different expressions of possible BMW truck and land on this particular one, which I personally love to see as a performance oriented BMW truck based on the large X7 SUV platform, guys. A quick disclaimer here though, what I put here is by no means any official rendering coming from BMW Motor Corporation, guys. This is a personal expression from an influencer. So if you take a good look at what we've put there, it looks bold, it looks great, it looks futuristic as well. And I think this would pass for a BMW M power truck, full size M power truck, guys. So if you take a good look at how the LEDs, LED headlights have been integrated, it's well done. And I am digging the kidney grill and how bold and well it's been integrated here. Then below the kidney grill, you've got this futuristic daytime 
running lights, I don't know, some kind of fog lights, which is well integrated with some rocker panels just below it. That makes it look futuristic and protected as well when you are probably off-roading. And then when you come to the site, I love the fact that there are vents from the um, front fender that exits in the front bumper. And that is well done. I wish if it happened, it didn't come as a cheap plastic opening, but a real vent for cooling and performance reasons. And then the running board on the side is also great looking. And this is by no means an official production, but I wish BMW would do something like this. It will milk them a lot of cash. But the point is that BMW previously has said that they are not going to do bad engineering with their pickup truck if they ever did. BMW would want a truck that drives like a BMW and Mercedes lends the hardware with the X-Class, which drove terribly according to most people who piloted it. So in 2019, BMW actually built an X7 based pickup truck. I'm sure you are aware of that. This one, yes. But we suspect that when the X7 goes electric, we might see an electric pickup truck come to be or materialize. Now, while this particular BMW X7 pickup truck was not a mass produced offering, BMW made a one of one. And that was based on the X7 as earlier stated, a group of vocational trainees that were at BMW at the time worked with a concept vehicle construction and model technology divisions to create this truck. And the cargo bed featured polished wood. There was a BMW F850 GS motorbike back there. You can see that. And the rig debuted in 2019 during BMW Motorrad days. We really hope that now that the Cybertruck is a thing that has come to stay and garnered so much interest, BMW will not sleep over these guys. And I love this one. What do you think? Do you think this can pass for an empowered BMW X7 truck? Put your comments in the comment section below. Thank you so much. Have a good great day until we meet same time again. Bye-bye.